New to Kamloops, the local Luna and Mac Koshish are here to open the doors for local artists. Well, we moved to Kamloops from Toronto six months ago, but before that we had once visited Kamloops and we fell in love with the city. We went to the farmer's market here. We spoke to the artists and artisans and we realized that it's not just like any other market, it's a whole community helping each other. This farmer's market is basically a community event. Baloka and Matt discovered that the pandemic actually has a silver lining for those out of work. When COVID happened, we lost our jobs in Toronto and we just wanted to bring a small, we're just two ordinary people who want to change a little in the society, bring more value to arts and artisans, and we decided Kamloops is the best place for that. Local Kamloops artisans are grateful for Voloka and Matt's Bazaar, as the pandemic has been especially rough on them and their businesses. It's so important for small businesses to have a place where they can go and they can set up shop and they can vend their wares. I saw this advertised on Facebook, I believe, and I messaged them and put in my application and then came down to meet them and it seemed like a really cool idea. For these artists, their passions now produce a profit. People are getting more time because they do not have regular jobs. They're getting more time to work on their passion and hobbies. And we just found it to be the right time for society to come together and help the artisans. It has been hard. Um, I'm a music instructor and a music teacher as my day job. Also, the reason why we wanted to start this around COVID is because this is the time when we need to help the artists and artisans. The Artisans Bazaar will be a permanent spot for local artists to show their work. For Castanet Kamloops, I'm Brianne Foley.